You know that big, scary climate change number everyone talks about? The goal to keep global warming under 1.5 degrees Celsius? Well, hold on to your hats because some scientists are saying we might have blown past that target years ago. The Paris Climate Accord set 1.5 degrees as the magic number, the line we absolutely shouldn't cross to avoid the worst effects of climate change. We all thought we were getting close, but a new study from the University of Western Australia has dropped a bombshell. They think we actually passed that 1.5 degree mark way back in 2020. So how did they figure this out? It's pretty wild. They studied something called sclera sponges from the Caribbean. Think of these sea sponges as nature's time capsules. They grow incredibly slowly, less than a millimeter a year, and their limestone skeletons lock away clues about the ocean's temperature over centuries. By analyzing the chemical makeup of these sponges, researchers created a temperature timeline stretching all the way back to the 1700s. Their findings suggest that the Earth started warming about 80 years earlier than our official records indicate. If they're right, we didn't just pass 1.5 degrees. We might have hit 1.7 degrees of warming in 2020. This basically means the clock is ticking even faster than we thought. The lead author of the study said our timeline for cutting emissions to avoid disaster has been cut short by at least a decade. In his words, basically time's running out. Now, before you panic, it's important to know that not everyone in the science community is convinced. Some experts are skeptical. They argue that data from sponges in just one part of the world, the Caribbean, might not be enough to rewrite the entire global temperature record. The world's oceans are vast and incredibly complex there, saying it's a huge claim to make based on one regional study. The official body, the IPCC, still says we're hovering around 1.2 degrees of long-term warming, so who's right? The truth is, we don't know for sure yet, but here's the thing. Even if the sponges are off, other evidence shows we are dangerously close to that 1.5 degree threshold right now. This past January was the hottest ever recorded, hitting 1.7 degrees above pre-industrial levels for that month. We've now had a full year where temperatures have stayed above the 1.5 degree line. While that doesn't mean the long-term average has officially crossed over, it's a massive warning sign flashing right in our faces. Ultimately, whether we pass the line in 2020 or are about to cross it tomorrow, the message from the science is crystal clear. Climate change is a crisis that requires immediate, all-hands-on-deck action. We have to cut our emissions now. After all, whether it's our thermometers or the ancient sea sponges talking there, both telling us the same urgent story. Thanks for watching, and if you want to stay updated on stories like this, make sure to subscribe.